what does Devonte Adams look like up close and personal working out to you? Devontae, Devontae Adams is probably the smoothest mover on the football field I've ever seen in my life. You know, it's just, I don't even know how to describe it. You know, it's not like over the top, like freakiness with what he does have explosion and quickness, but it's just like, I don't know, man. It's like, nobody can really dictate the pace at which he moves. He he moves how he moves and everybody else just has to, you know, get with the program. But yeah, just watching him release and move through his route so fluidly. I've, I've never seen anything like it. Well, I mean, you know, it's so rare for somebody of his talent to be moved or, or want to move. And, um, uh, his relationship with Derek Carr, though, uh, is something that makes his movement to Vegas and this team unique. And normally somebody of his talent coming in, there still would be a period of trying to get on the same page with the quarterback. I'm wondering if you've already witnessed the sixth sense these two kids, if you will, have those crazy Fresno kids have on this field right now for you and your team. You seen it? Yeah, I mean, I've, I've seen a large number of touchdown connections between the two over the matter of the last month and a half. Um, but yeah, you can just tell like they, and if, and if something isn't like particularly precise, like how quick they adjust and mm. fix it. And then now it's just money. Like, so it's, you can tell that that connection that's been there for years is already taking place and it's already like paying off for them as far as how they adjust and just, you know, how they, step out there and dominate like you expect like okay like this is going to be a, a money connection and it's been <laughs> it's been that way from the jump it's very entertaining to watch now i know there's no iron waller but have you gone up to Derek and say hey don't forget your buddy at the tight end position from the last several years we have a sixth sense too have you had a conversation similar to that to Derek Carnell? i haven't i haven't even had to do it because he, he, he's he's uh, putting it up there to everybody man like mm. you know Monte getting his and then it's like you see the, de- the defense will you know kind of shift through their focusing on from day to day and it's like all right well focus on me put it up today they focus on day both me or hunters over the middle just wiggling around making people look stupid so it's it's been it's been very fun so far and i'm excited to see you know how it continues to take place over time and how does josh mcdaniel's offense move you around like the chess pieces you can be what do you think what are you seeing um yeah i mean it's, it's really everywhere you know i gotta be on the p's and q's uh as far as the book is concerned because it's Inside, outside, single, by yourself, you know, in a trips formation. So it's like pretty much everywhere. I'm excited about the challenge that it presents because, you know, it makes it harder for people to really know where you're going to be at. So he's diversifying your game in a way that it has not been in, in, your, in your tenure there in Vegas? Is that what you're saying? Uh, yeah, they're bringing new things to the table for sure. Um, I've done a lot of things under – under Coach Gruden, mm-hmm. and I feel like that's been very helpful, and they're asking us to do even more things. So it's just just add more to the bag and uh, gives us more opportunities to get open when you know defenses are going to be looking for you. 